Welcome to the salt circle lap. I didn't decide what this is. I mean, I can turn it into whatever you want it to be. <laughs> uh, I'm here with Ben Wolf. Yeah. Yeah. So fucking Hank, Hank asked me if I've heard of a thing. <laughs> as the thing is Bea Wolf. B E A space W O L F. Bea Wolf. And it's a little girl. I'm like, no, I fucking haven't, but I bought it. <laughs> that instantaneous. This shit came out like what? Like a week ago? It was like the 21st or 24th or something like that. Um, yeah. It like just dropped. And uh-huh. I wouldn't have. It would have been like another at best. At best a month before I would have learned about it. Like maybe two months. I Every once in a while, I like. At, at at most every two months I I like do a peek and see if there's any like new Beowulf content that dropped. <laughs> a new uh-huh. annotation or something. And I like just looked. So I was like I was like, nope, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> it proves you gotta check this shit daily. You gotta do your Beowulf searches. Um and it looked fucking incredible. It's by Zach What's his last name? Wiener Smith. Wiener Smith? Zach Wiener Smith. Um yeah. behind He the, does the webcomic Saturday morning breakfast cereal. Yeah. Yeah. And that Which was is very different. Yeah, yeah. Totally, totally different style. Like you wouldn't fucking know um from looking at it. And well, like he he didn't do the art for this book. Yeah, yeah. And on the cover it had a fucking the thing that really that like got me extra hyped, even though he hasn't done an adaptation, which is kind of sad. The Neil Gaiman quote, like, glorious, accurate, profoundly, profoundly silly, and hilariously profound. I'm like, I'm like, let's, I'm so fucking ready. <laughs> and I, there was no, there was no PDF. So I bought the hardcover, shipped it to my parents' house, and I bought the, <laughs> the ebook so I could read it. <laughs> the things yeah, I'm with, hold, currently holding the physical book. You son of a bitch. Because <laughs> I live in a place where mail is easy. I, look, I could have gotten it shipped here, but I needed to read it right that fucking second. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I paid the twelve dollars to to get it right now. That's whatever. Meh. Uh, we got a new intro. We got "Hey, wait," <laughs> which is fucking incredible because <laughs> the old English is like "wait" or whatever. Uh-huh. Like, that's just mm. the fucking. All the alliteration, we got a shitload of Kennings. The art is fucking incredible. Yes. God, this thing is so fucking good. <laughs> like this, the Beowulf just payoff like, is fucking coming in hard. Oh. And it it's like it, it's a full adaptation. Yeah, like, like it hits all it, the other same than notes. The, like it doesn't it doesn't actually do the full story, but Yeah, that's a little sad. I'm hoping there's a second one. Yeah, hopefully. Yeah, no, the fact that um, it like I wouldn't I wouldn't have blamed him, I I don't think, if he would have just done like the Beowulf stuff, right? Like just the uh-huh. the meat of the story. But no, they fucking adapt like the intro, Beowulf's like origin and the stuff with Hrothgar and like his lineage and shit. They do all of the aside stuff, like it's so good. Yeah. It's so okay. unnecessary and incredible. And it's all for kids. Like, yeah. It's just <laughs> fucking good. Like, instead of drinking mead, they're drinking soda. <laughs> uh huh. Like, he finds a horde and his parents say, save it for college. He says, <laughs> no. <laughs> Takes it to the toy store. Oh, oh! And like the t- like the fucking and like instead of dying, it's just he becomes a teen, so he yeah. has to hand off the trove <laughs> yeah. to another kid. Yeah, he becomes a teenager. <laughs> They're all like fucking burning stuff, like toys. <laughs> then tro- he's in the teen lands. He's working. Uh, he was seen later in the teen lands, sacking groceries, gaining job skills. <laughs> Lament not his low fate. Time lingers for no kid. 
Like, <laughs> it's just fucking incredible. <laughs> oh. Oh, Instead of building it's... a hall, they build the tree house. Uh-huh. Uh, I was wondering what the fuck they were going to do. Because I didn't really look at this much. Like, I didn't look at, like a summary or screen like i think there's a uh, preview chapter out there online like the first uh-huh. chapter or whatever i didn't do any of that i just bought it <laughs> like so i'm yeah, wondering yeah, what yeah. the fuck's going on how are they gonna handle like grendel's arm getting ripped off right what's grendel gonna look like and it's fucking grindle and he's just a fucking miserable adult <laughs> uh-huh god <laughs> he's all lanky all the adults are just drawn like terrible fucking monsters Oh yeah, just oh. fucking lo- lanky ass arms and legs. Yeah, like super long fingers, and he's like hunched. Just <laughs> binge watching cable news. <laughs> yeah, miserable. Eats plain yogurt <laughs> and yolkless eggs for every breakfast. <laughs> and he doesn't kill people. He fucking turns them old and boring. Uh huh. Oh, that shit was such a good... And it's such a good way for, like, Grendel's whole deal about, like, you can't stand the sounds of mirth. Yeah, <laughs> So, like, uh-huh. this is the perfect deal for it. Oh. Yeah. That is... Him going in and cleaning the treehouse. He clean. Yeah, he doesn't fucking wreck it. He fucking cleans it and, like, organizes shit. He puts a uh, brush your teeth poster on the wall. Oh. He flosses twice a day. Flosses twice a day. Man, I'm looking at the fucking page of the, the clean hall. I love education. <laughs> Healthy vegetable. <laughs> oh. I really can't overstate like how much I love the art. Yeah. Like it's I don't know how to describe it. Like as a as a vibe. It's kind of like you could see it being unsettling, but it's not, you know, mm-hmm. like the elements are there a little bit. Like this person could draw horror or does. I, I don't I don't recognize the name. What is it? Bull something. Bullet. 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 French. He's French, apparently. Makes sense. And like. Yeah, just all of the the way that it works so fucking well is like a thing about kids and adults and how everything just worked as far as adapting it. Like the timeline being like instead of for however many years, it's like 12 days have passed <laughs> before uh-huh. it gets to uh, Beowulf. <laughs> and then they're going down the river in the inner tubes. Yeah. God. It's just so, it's just like every page is amazing. <laughs> yeah, like literally every page is just <laughs> incredibly delightful. <sighs> the writing is great. I, as someone who really loves alliteration and loves Kennings uh-huh. and, re- and related stuff, like this was just fucking incredible. Like it's just, that's all it is. <laughs> Is is that shit? Um, did you did you read the the afterward thing? Uh, no, I was gonna, but I did not get to it. Okay, it's it's pretty good. I mean, it's your usual standard shit, except like the it's just written, like the human speaks, <laughs> I guess, instead of like stuffy. Yeah, um, yeah. He was talking about how he was like, you know, he's shown his kids as he writes and stuff. And he was explaining what Kennings are like to his family or whatever. And his kids were creating one. I forgot what, what one of them, the, like they, his daughter came up with like joke teller and like diaper destroyer for like a baby or something. <laughs> I'm like, that's per Like, this is what this book is. <laughs> like, it's just totally in line. It's like a, also a great like kids book, like to read to a kid or whatever, or just to have a mm-hmm. kid read. And Bea is adorable. <laughs> He's got that fucking battle bear, whatever the hell you call it. 
hat yeah. plush thing. Fucking the like the way what draws like the kid being like out of their mind like yelling face. <laughs> yeah, <So>. yeah. <laughs> the battle cry. Yeah, dude. And just like the like the constant sugar shit. Like they're all they eat chocolate and soda and shit. That is them like zonked out all over the floor. Uh huh. Man. Like when she when she approaches the Rogers throne. Oh yeah. And he's like upside down sitting in it, but like they're like tears running down his face. <laughs> yeah, dude. And then she's like, My name is Beowulf. That pan page. That, that page that is full page. so fucking good. <laughs> like that's the that's the image. The little boots. Yeah, so man. Good. The boots, the fucking the bear, the shirt that just says wolf. <laughs> huh. <laughs> oh and then the, the fucking pig farmer. The pig with farm, his the, fucking drones. The fact that they do the <laughs> The fucking aside where, like, how he, they do the full story of, like, how King Roger, you know, Hrothgar, is, like, related, yeah. relationship-wise, uh-huh. the, the Bea is fucking just good. Dressing up as ninjas, they're going to... At sunrise, the, the fence builder found it, felt <laughs> confused. <laughs> well, time to retire. <laughs> Fucking the uh, <laughs> finished feasting, they fell about the tunnel walls. We must repen the pigs and pay the peace price. King Kai swallowed his cake. It cannot be done. Not in 10,000 hours. No. Ours is an oinky fate. Fucking pigs just laying around. <laughs> oh. uh, they're smuggling their vegetables. God, it's so good. Yeah, the, the, the it's so page, good. The page of the dude with the pig, and they're on a golf course. Uh huh. Oh. Man, in the shit, uh, you could tell that like guy, the illustrator was like ready to go fucking hard because we had the the hunter. What was his fucking hunter Huffer? <laughs> uh, our Unfort, uh, Unferth, like standed. Like say so like, hey, uh-huh. weren't you the one who lost this contest with here Becky <laughs> uh-huh. instead of Brecca? Um, and she like explains why he's wrong and shit. And they actually do like the sea monster stuff, like yeah. the page with the big sea monster in the ocean, and then the next one is like a just <laughs> fucked up creature. <laughs> it's like. A turtle with a bunch of parrot heads or whatever, and like a, a squid with snakes for tentacles. The, like inverse submarine with the fucking like ghosts hanging out on it. Yeah, dude. Seven headed snapping turtle. <laughs> yeah, just like the reverse mermaid. The reverse mermaid fucking <laughs> killed me. Oh. That shit was so good. I love like the her the the page of her walking out of the water is so good. Uh, the one where it's like a I don't know what to I don't know how to describe it, but it's like a almost a slightly different style or whatever. Not a different style. The one where it's uh, top down. Yeah. What page is that? 134. Oh, I was. I would scroll to it and then I scrolled back. Uh, what the fuck? I think it's the one I'm just gonna say. Just like the ripples in the water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that shit's so good. It def- that's definitely a standout. The figure illustrations for the start of the chapters. Circles. It's just all so fucking good. It's just all so fucking it's just, good. It's like just perfect. Yeah. Like, oh is, man. This is like a perfect fucking piece of media. <laughs> like, yeah. No notes. Yeah. It's like, the only <laughs> note is please finish it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. 
Oh, I need man. the the rest. I need that. Yeah, dude. Like, <laughs> it's funny as hell too, cause it's still Beowulf, and it still gets me. So like when we're doing the cool epic shit, like I'm still getting a bit of goosebumps and like losing my mind because it's just epic. Uh, like the story itself is just epic. Yeah. <laughs> Except it's just incredible here. <laughs> oh, this uh, is like man. This this is the best adaptation. Yeah, dude. Like I I didn't know I needed it, <laughs> but here we are. Like. <laughs> It's probably going to be one of, if not my favorite thing to come out in 2023. Like, this is just, yeah, this is why we do it. <laughs> uh-huh. I was tempted, too, to fucking send it to my uh, my professor <laughs> that we did the Beowulf uh-huh. with. Like, have you oh, seen yeah. this? You need to read this. Man, the, uh, the panel, not panel, it's page. <laughs> Uh, 149 when she's looking at when Grindel comes and they face off she sh- she searched his spectacles saw no fear only a vast joy void empty his vacuum his soul was a snowbank unsledded a snow cone unsweetened a snowman unscarfed and it's just that fucking drawing is just so good the lighting the, the lighting is just dude knows what he's doing And then her, like, beating the shit out of him. <laughs> this is just great. Dodging his fingers. Yeah, dude. Grabbing his wrists. Twisted his arms around his back. I fucking love that the 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 stand-in for him getting his arm torn off was her ripping his tie off. Uh-huh. And he reverts back. Turns out he was a kid. I got corrupted. Fucking goofy kid. Yeah. Runs off. <laughs> shot of the mom really mad. <laughs> his mom's all pissed. <laughs> Man, the the page of her with the tie, like hold, like sitting and holding the tie above her head. Yeah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> yeah. No, I. Um... It just fucking hits, dude. Just yeah, fucking it's it goes hard. What a a a great idea, like perfectly executed. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> like there's so many ways you could have flopped it. And it just doesn't. Mm-hmm. It not a not a single way does it drop the ball. It's just a perfect thing. Yeah. I mean this is you know the the recommendation is to check it out, but the bigger recommendation is to like read Beowulf <laughs> and then read this. Kind of true. Cause Beowulf's good. Yeah, Beowulf is fucking. And this solid. is a, this is a great way to like take that material and uh, do something new with it. Yeah, man. Well, and it's. Not- what if Frostgar bangs Beowulf's <laughs> mom? <laughs> or Grendel's mom. Oh my god. Can you fucking imagine <laughs> we get a volume two and it turns out Roger's mom is <laughs> or Roger's dad is with Grend- Grendel's mom? Uh, no. I mean the payoff for fucking watching all the adaptations where Hrothgar bangs Grendel's mom <laughs> is that we both saw that creature in Sailor Moon a pretty guardian yes. server and said hey it's Grendel's mom <laughs> like the fact that we both came to that conclusion is <laughs> that's you know makes the whole thing worth it he actually it's does the... mention uh, also in the afterward because he talks about like the history of um like Beowulf, like it's a pretty solid afterward. Like he's talking about old English and shit. Like it's pretty yeah, academic, yeah. I think. Um, <clears throat> but while also still being like silly and fun, and he actually uh, he hits a couple of translations that I haven't read yet. So now I got even more Beowulf to check out. Nice, <laughs> except like you know slightly stuffier versions, but whatever. Yeah. 
No bro. No bro. Though they're also not Tolkien. Tolkien's is like just I mean it's Tolkien. It's dense as shit. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's all I got. Yeah, it's, it's just fucking it's just amazing. Really fucking incredible. And I just it's like I can't believe it's Beowulf. So we yeah, you know, we got this. Now the only like we need the we need the second volume. We need to finish the story. Um And I mean the thing that they're for those for those who don't know the, the Beowulf story, uh Basically, the the three big things that Beowulf does, aside from uh, some other aside stories that we get in the in the poem, is Beowulf defeats Grendel. Well, he rips his arm off. Grendel runs home to his mom. Uh, Beowulf, Grendel's mom comes and fucks the hall up. Beowulf goes and fucks up Grendel's mom, and then beheads Grendel, <laughs> brings his head back, or brings her head back. I'm actually blanking right now. He brings a head back. And it's yeah, it's, I, I think so. Um, and then uh, we get a time, we get a time skip and we get old Beowulf uh, defeating a dragon, but, but dying in the process. And it's a whole big thing and it's great. So this, this story ends with uh, Grendel returning, well, Grindel <laughs> returning to his, his mom. And we get, like, he goes, I forget, I forget how it ends exactly. He does, like, yeah, he, like, he does a little, like, teaser thing. Like, it's really, uh. Yeah, it's like, that's a story for another time. Yeah, yeah. But he, like, touches on some of the cool parts of, like, that part of the story. <laughs> so I'm hoping there's more. Um, so we need the second volume, and then we just. Hey, we get the, we get the like. Of like Grindel's mom like streaming up kids, yeah, and like yeah, and crochet cocoons, yeah. <laughs> and she just talks of uh, she, oh how she would talk of antiquing till time became ice. <laughs> <laughs> and all the kids are just fucking bored. <laughs> uh, Hanging from the ceiling. That's such a good page. <laughs> also, yeah, we just need the Junji Ito. Adapta- adaptation now and we're like we have it all that's true it's the white <laughs> whale oh, this was a what a what a great surprise came out of nowhere <laughs> yeah yeah when I went to go visit my friend last weekend he just had that he had it already oh yeah that's oh, right like, I, oh <laughs> yeah I, I forgot to ask entirely like how you'd came upon it yeah my That's friend just hilarious. had uh, had gotten the copy he's <laughs> more he's more up on snbc oh him. okay i i got you that makes sense that's <laughs> that's pretty good yeah hell yeah oh i hi- highly recommend checking it out two thumbs up yeah big my thumb up. and ben's thumb <laughs> that's oh, how that man. works literally a 10 out of 10 for me like yeah no exaggeration it's just perfect what a good comic uh salt circle podcast gmail.com salt circle pod on twitter wherever f- fine podcasts are found i'm on twitter at comic panels i'm peace at peace, peace.